Hello again. So in this uh, video, uh, I will show you how to create a push down automaton for a given uh, context free language. Okay. So here I have this context free language. So that's a zero, uh, zero power n and one power two n. So what does that mean? This language here. Uh, so if you have, for example, a zero in the left, so we must uh, we must overwrite two ones in the right. So if we have, for example, two zeros, we must have also four ones. So the number of ones in the right side equal two times the number of zeros in the left side. For example, three zeros. So must we have uh, six ones, okay? So let's get started now. <clears throat> so uh, first of all, so let's, I assume that we have this stock here. So, and we have Z initially in our stock, okay? So, Let's create initial state uh, Q0 for example. So uh, initially so we have that Z in the top uh, of the stack. So and we initially read zero. So uh, if we read zero and we have Z in the top of uh, the stack so we add uh, Z to uh, we, so we push a okay so we add a on the top of the of the stack okay so if we have also uh, zero if we read zero and we have a on the top of the stack so we just put uh, we just push an other a so we just add an other a on the top of the stack okay so uh, and we can also uh, move to Q1 uh, without reading the the input okay so the input is our uh, language okay so zeros and ones okay so here in Q1 so here, notice that whenever so we read a zero in the input, so we add a, we stock a, okay? So here, what I want to do, so I just want to, in each type I read a, I find a, so I will write, I read two times one. Okay, so how I can do that? So I can just use two rules. Okay, so the first, so if I read one and I find a in the top of the stack, so I just replace uh, a with b. Okay, and if I read one and I have b in the in the top of the stack so I replace it by epsilon so I pop it okay I just remove the okay so and if I have Z in the top uh, if, if I have Z in the top of the stack so I go to Q2 so without without read anything so with epsilon okay so if we have Z so I uh, I let it so without push or pop so I just go to this uh, acceptance uh, place here okay so that's it so let's uh, let's check this for example let's check this uh, this string for example so initially we are so that's the the initial state 
So, so if I read zero, so I read zero if I have A or Z in the top. So here I have, so initially I have Z in the top. So I execute this. So I read zero and I push A. Okay, so I push A and I stay in the same uh, in the same state and I increment the place. Okay, so here I have zero. So with zero, so now I have A in the top of the stack. Okay, so I can run this. Okay. So, because here I read zero, so I must read zero here. So, I just push, so, so now I have A, so I push, I add an other A, okay? So that's it. And, uh, so I go to Q0, I stay in Q0, so here I can't fire any one of those two okay because here I read one so I can just move with the, the silent symbol to Q1 okay so I just uh, move to Q1 without read the input because that's the silent here that's the silent uh, symbol here so here so I have A so and I read one okay so what so I have so that's one here and one here but in the top of the stack I have A so I can't fire this so I can just execute this so I execute uh, I execute this so by replacing I by B so I replace I by B so and I move to this one here and I stay in the same place okay so here so I have so I read one from Q1 of course I read one by but in the top of the stack I have B so I can't read this because this need to be A in the top so I can read this uh, I can fire this so when I fire so I just so go to the next one here with the same state but I replace B by epsilon so I remove it so here what I can do so I am at the, in the state Q1 and in the top of the stack link of the stack I have A so what I can do so I can just fire this so here I can't fire this because this need to be a Z in the top of the stack okay so here so I can read this I can fire this so and I stay in the same state because that's just a loop but I replace I by B so that's I I replace it by B okay so and here so what I can do, so I am in the state Q1 and I read 1 and in the top of the stack is B. So I can't fire this because this need A to be in the top. So I can just fire this. So when I fire this, so I move to this one, to this play place here and I replace B by epsilon. So I remove it. So here I am in the Q1 place and I don't have so that's new here because I uh, I read all of the inputs and so that's in the top of the stack I have Z so I can move with the, the new okay because that's new here and that's new here and Z is in the top so I can just uh, I can just move now from this state to this state okay so without fire anything okay so what's that mean that this string is uh, acceptable by this uh, auto push down 
uh, automatic. Okay, that means that this string is uh, is acceptable in this language. Okay, so uh, I hope that you uh, enjoy watching this video. So in the next video, we'll see also how to uh, create a push down automaton. For example, for uh, zero power n and two and one power n minus two for example okay so just uh, check the description below and see you later